I'm going to quickly show you how to change the vertical alignment of a road. To edit the vertical alignment, we go to the centerline tools and show long section button. We then hover the mouse over the road that we want to select and left click to choose it. That will then open up the long section as you can see here. We can use the scroll wheel to zoom in and see what was going on a bit clearer. To add a vertical intersection point, we use the add point button. And then you move your mouse over and choose which part of the vertical long section you want to add your vertical IP into and left click. As you move the mouse now, you can see that you're going to choose where you want to add this in. Left click to accept those locations. And we can do that again. So I can then on the right hand side, left click that line and continue to add in vertical IPs as I choose. To add in vertical curves, we can use the add curve button. So select that one and then choose a vertical IP to add a curve to by left clicking over it. As you move the mouse, you can see you are manually choosing the length of that curve. You can left click to accept it. Or if you want to, you can right click over a vertical IP and enter the curve length. So if I do that here, we can then type in either a curve length or a K or an R value. So in here, I'm going to put in an appropriate value of something like 30 meters and then click OK. And we can do that for the others as well. That's it. The centerline now has been modified and the road has been automatically updated in both the plan and the 3D to show the vertical changes. Thank you.